Episode 7, we watched the boys solve the case of the ghost who was possessing the various uh, plushy costumes, um, which was, like I said, weird, but hopefully fun. Who are you? It's me, Sam! It's Sully! What? We're friends, like best friends. <laughs> you remember? Dude, who are you talking to? Him? In episode eight, we're going to dive into another one of our, uh, I would call it our bittersweet episodes, where the boys are going to be dealing with the world of imaginary friends, which opens up certain memories for Sam. Ever think about running away? As he remembers his imaginary friend growing up. It's pretty bizarre for us, and uh, but ultimately it, it, it's pretty touching as well, I think. The cage, Lucifer's cage? Yeah. What if he's telling me I have to go back? What if he's saying that's where the answer is to beating the darkness? In terms of the darkness, Sam having admitted to Dean in episode seven at the very end that he thinks God is telling him to go visit Lucifer in the cage is never very far beneath the surface here in this episode. In Iranian lore, Xana are creatures who guide and protect lost children. Xana intentionally appear as figments of the child's imagination, allowing the child to move on with confidence once guidance is no longer necessary. The sort of question hanging over the episode is, Will Sam uh, have the courage to face what is probably his greatest fear, which is returning to uh, Lucifer's cage? I think God wants me to go back. <laughs>